Hey, welcome to 1500ESPN.com. I'm Derek Wetmore on a Sunday afternoon evening in Fort Myers, Florida. Today the Twins had a ribbon cutting ceremony for the new Hammond Stadium, a bunch of renovations and updates in the whole complex. It used to be called Lee County Sports Complex, now they're calling it CenturyLink Sports Complex. Some pretty impressive stuff including the Twins Minor League Academy and facilities. I got a full tour of that today with some other reporters guided by Bill Smith and I can't express how you know impressed I was with the whole thing. Uh, there's a bunch of photos I took. Uh, if you want to go look on my Twitter account, I posted all of those or in our chat on the website. Uh, it's pretty hard to express in pictures, though, how impressive some of that stuff is. Really state-of-the-art stuff. A lot of people with the Twins and the county are saying they're kind of back to being state-of-the-art as they feel they were in 1991. Here we are in 2015, and they've now done a bunch of I think necessary updates. I didn't see the place two years ago when it was apparently a little bit worse, but some of the players I talked to said this is a, a needed and welcomed renovation, and it looks to me anyway, from my untrained eye, like they really did it right here at the at Hammond Stadium and kind of the surrounding sports complex. Uh, in Twins news today, not a lot because pitchers and catchers just reported, but we'll have plenty more from Monday, certainly. I spoke with General Manager Terry Ryan in a short setting with a couple of other reporters. And one of the news items that we got is that Gardenhire won't be doing anything. Ron Gardenhire, that is, team's former manager, who was fired after last season and then offered a job in the organization. He's apparently turned down that job for the time being and will take the year off, according to Terry Ryan, who wouldn't be surprised to see Gardenhire get back into managing in some capacity in the future. I don't think I would be either. We'll be curious, anyways, to see what happens this major league season and maybe into next offseason if Gardenhire is among one of the top candidates for the jobs that are sure to be open. Every year there's some turnover in major league baseball. In terms of player news, there wasn't a lot either. Terry Ryan said he didn't expect anybody to have any problems with reporting. Pitchers and catchers, of course, were today and they'll start their workouts tomorrow on Monday. I'll have another episode edition of the video from Monday after practice, after talking to the players, after workouts and everything like that. Uh, if there's any Twins news, of course, I'll report it. You can also check out all of the coverage on the website, 1500ESPN.com. We've got sort of a live stream going. Anything from spring training, we'll be feeding it into that chat. Additionally, you can check out my 25-man roster projection. That's on the website right now, as well as the latest stories on the Twins beat. So, until I check in with you next time, this has been Derek Wetmore from Hammond Stadium, just outside Hammond Stadium anyway. I'll check back with you tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Catch you next time.